Hello everybody. I want to come in today and do a video with you all. Um, as you can see, I have dreads. I've been growing my dreads for three years. Three years I've been growing my dreads and April made three years. And um, this is my natural hair color. I've always had this hair color. And I want to do something different. So I hope you enjoyed today's video, today's video because I'm going to be coloring my locks. But not using dye. I'm using this hair paint that I received that I got from Amazon. And um this is the name of it. Can you see that? It is Mo Mofange hair coloring. And so I wanted to try it. And the color is, I don't know if you can see that, orange. So, I want to try it. And I want to try it with you all. If that's alright with you. And uh, this will be the first time coloring my hair with any kind of hair color. <laughs> even though it's not permanent. But, um, yeah. I've seen a lot of people dye their hair permanently with dreads. And it damages and it break off and it split and all of that. And I don't want that to happen to mine. I love that my hair is growing. I love the length. And so I don't want to lose on any of it by wanting to color it and mess it up. So this is how the packaging comes. It has this lid. I took the lid off. It's closed up. So it's sealed up. So let's unseal it. And this is what it looks like. And I chose this orange because it's fall, winter. So I wanted something fally looking. So, I hope it looks good, <laughs> but that's the good thing. If it don't, I can wash it right on out today. So, let's get started, okay? Put that inside the lid and put that on the floor because I do not want to get that on my clothes or anything like that, which I just have this white tank top on, so if it get on that, that's fine, but, so... Take a little bit in my finger and I band all my hair off in rubber bands so that it'd be an easier process. So I'm just going to take it, rub it in my fingers, and just put it in my hair. It smells good. It smells like perfume. <laughs> it smells like perfume, y'all. So I don't really see much on that. I see some, a little bit, so I'm going to put some more, okay? And I'm going to push it in, the hair, because I don't want it just to be sitting on top looking like it is, you know. I want it to look like it's color. I don't want it to look like it's paint, you know? Well, that's what it looks like. I don't know. I'm just continuing with the process. Like I said, if I don't like it, I can just take it back out. And then I can wash it around back out. So. And no, I don't have on gloves. I'm just using my fingers. Um, with no gloves or nothing on. So, I'll see how it washes off my hand when I finish too, I guess. <laughs> some color on it so this one I can need more color
Okay, it's doing something because it doesn't look like my normal hair color, so it's color getting in it. <laughs> it's changing the color. Yeah, so all right, that's one bubble band. Let's continue on, okay. Okay, you can see my hair, you can see the color and compare it to my hair, you know. So, I don't know. Should I do the whole thing? I don't know. We'll see the end results, huh? We'll see if I did the whole head or if I did half at the end. Or if I just made some, some um, streaks in my hair, you know. Just did some of them. We'll see at the end. I really don't know what I'm going to do right now. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. So, I'm just going to continue the process.
half done. Start with the other side. <laughs> Love is over, guys. It's probably a longer process because I'm doing one strand at a time, but. I like, I like the results better with one strand at a time because even with putting it on in a bundle, it seems like I still had to go back. So I'd rather do it one strand at a time. It might be a little bit more time consuming, but you know. Now, yeah, here's the process too. It ain't like this quick, so you need to split the stuff on it and send it. I mean, yeah, get it in a bag or whatever and let it just sit, but it's still a process. So patience is a virtue. <laughs> my lighting so let me fix that all right so that's that for that ponytail so i'm loving it i'm loving it so let's continue <laughs> I'm almost finished, y'all. I think it's like the second ponytail over here. The second band up, so I think I got like three more bands to go. But, um, but yeah. I'm loving it so far. So far, I'm loving it. And a lot of people I seen doing this was um they were saying wet your hair, but they were saying it, it you know it, it it ran and stuff. So I decided not to wet my hair because I don't want to run it everywhere. So I'm gonna see how it works, what the results is without you know spraying it with water, just doing it on it dry. Because I don't want it to be all runny and get on my clothes and pillowcases and all that. Hair, you know I don't want it to be doing all that. 
So I'm gonna try you dry. That's what I see it. And that's what I'm doing. <laughs> So far, I'm loving it. It's giving me an auburn type um, look to my hair. Which my hair isn't black anyway, but my mom said it wasn't black. It was red. She dyed it black. She, you know, liked it black. You know, I know something about people liking their hair black and shiny. I don't know. Which I tried black when I was younger. Like middle school. I hated it. <laughs> I hated it. So I'm going to be back. You know, I'm going to be back to correct my regular color and everything. So. I used to wear weeds. I used to get, you know, a brownish color. I didn't want black because, like I said, I didn't like black at all. When it just didn't stand me out like that, you know. Not really stand me out. It just made me. It didn't go with my. It didn't go with me, you know. It just didn't. To me, it just didn't look natural. I guess you'll say it didn't look like it belonged <laughs> to me anyway. Maybe other people did, but to me, it didn't. So I'm almost done. I have two more bands. Oh, and just to let y'all know, if y'all can see my hats back there hanging up, I do love hats. I do. I do. And I will do a video on my hats and how I style them and everything like that. Just to show you all because you're my family. I love you all. I love you tuning in, watching me, and just spending time with me, you know? Like I tell you. You don't have to, but you do. And I thank you all for that, sincerely. Sincerely. So I will show y'all my hats. I will show y'all how I style my hats. I might do two separate videos about that. Just show you my hats first, and then do a video showing you how I will style them. You know? Um, wait a minute, I'm pulling the hair that's already been done. There we go. Don't want to pull no hair that's already been done. Because I ain't for doing it again. <laughs> I got it the way I want it. I don't need to put no more up there. And if I do, I'll see afterwards. But right now, it's looking like I want it a look. It's looking good. It's giving me a nice little vibrant color. Fally type of color. You know? You know? Yeah, no. <laughs> so, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. So, today is Saturday. Yeah. Yeah, December 12th. What was your plans for today? My plans were not this. I tell you that it was not to do this. But I just figured, hey, I'm home. Just go ahead and do it, right? Yeah, so yeah I could have did this Monday and had this upload Monday, which it, will, it probably will upload Monday. But I'm just saying I could have did it Monday and uploaded it Monday. But I knocked it out Saturday. And I'm uploaded Monday. So. You know. This would have been something if I you know, had 5,000. No, 1,000 subscribers is what I need. Yeah. If I had 1,000 subscribers. You know, you could start going live. This would have been something I did live. To talk to y'all, to get to know y'all. For y'all to get to know me. You know. Answering questions or whatever the case may be while doing my hair with you all. That would have been what I would have done. So now with that being said, <laughs> now let me get in my business mode. With that being said, you know, like the video, share the video, comment on the video, tell people to subscribe to the channel. 
I know I haven't been, you know, current all the time, but I'm going to start because I don't want to let my, you know, subscribers down. You know, I know some people I watch, I go look and they don't have videos loading and be like, hey, where the videos at? So, I don't want to do y'all like that. I don't want to do y'all like that. This is the last bundle. So, yeah, I don't want to do y'all like that. So, I'm going to start uploading more and everything for you all. Because, like I said, I love you all. And I love you all spending time with me and you know, just you know watching me and then like I said once I get those thousand subscribers I can go live I will go live and talk to you all and y'all can talk to me you know because I would love to do that I would love to talk to you all you know we all need somebody to talk to to vent to you know and all the time, family don't want to hear it. Friends don't want to hear it. Co-workers don't want to hear it. You know? So y'all can vent to me. <laughs> yep, y'all can vent right to me. And if I can try to help y'all solve a problem, hey, I do that too. Because we all need help. If somebody say they don't need help, they ain't never need the help. That person, I feel like they need help. Because we're not meant to do everything by ourselves. We're not. I know some people might be like, well, I can't depend on my family to help you. Yeah, I've been in that boat too. You know. When my mom was living and my mom helped me with anything. You know, but she passed away in two thousand seven. I have an older brother and an older sister. You know, and they just you know, my older brother will call and talk to me. My sister calls and talk to me sometimes, but she older, she don't really rock with me like that. <laughs> you know. And for a while it hurt. For a while it hurt because, you know, I feel like that was my sister, what you mean? But just because people family, you know, don't mean they're gonna be there for you. Everybody that always helped me has been friends, you know. Or maybe some, you know, cousins or whatever like that. But as far as like my brother, well, my brother, you know, he, um, he's considered schizophrenic. So, but, but he, you know, he called me. He loved me. He tell me he loved me all the time. You know, he he called me and talked to me more than my sister do, rather. <laughs> you know. Yeah. But everybody gonna need help at some point in life. That's just that's just factual. If you never think you're gonna need help, just keep living. You'll see. This pandemic probably showed a lot of people they need help. Cause people that had jobs that they weren't depending on nobody help have turned around and lost jobs and need, you know, some of everybody help. Some people that probably said, oh, I'll never be on food stamps and never be on welfare has turned that around because they have nothing else. So now they qualify for it and they need it, so they go get it. And I say, don't never say what it is, you know, you won't need or whatever, whatever, because you don't know. You don't know. You don't know. That's why I try not to burn bridges with people. Because I never know when I might need them. They never know when they might need me. You know, if I burn bridges with them and they need me, 
they might not come back and ask me for a favor, ask for help because they burned that bridge with me. You know? So, oh, people, this is the last piece. Last piece. I think that took about 30 or 40 minutes. Which normally the dyeing your hair probably would take a process too because you know after you dye then dyeing probably take about 15 20 minutes. Then you gotta condition it and blow dry it or whatever the case may be. Okay, babe. Okay. Okay. Okay, people. I think this is a winner. I think this is a winner right here. I think it's a winner. I think it's a winner, people. I love it. I really do. Did I get this piece? Hold on. Look, I ain't got a piece back there. Oh, yeah, I got it. No, oh, yeah, I think this is a winner, people. Maybe the ones I did first, you might need to rough them up a little bit. They look a little orangey, but the ones I did first. But then once I started just rubbing it in, I like that effect better. You know, it's not a big change because, like I said, my hair is already like a natural brown. But it is a change, you know. Let me wash my hands and I'll be right back. Okay, you all, I'm back and I've washed my hands. And this is the result. Nice and clean. My nails not stained or anything. So, this is a good product. I love the way it made my hair look. This is the front view. This is this side. This side. And then the back. So, yeah, people. I love it. I gotta take these bands off. Then I might leave them on because they're spaced and just gave me a middle part. So I might just leave them on. But um, yeah, I love it. It looks good. Um, again, it's can you see that? Both for Jang hair color and the color orange. Um, like I said, I love it. I think it looks good. See how I wear for a few days. Um, I have this white tank on and it didn't stain it as you can see. No stains, so I like that. <laughs> but um, let's see how I wear on my regular clothes. Don't want to stain my clothes. But um, yeah. So I'm about to put this back up and end this video. And like I said, subscribe. Get me to a thousand subscribers so we can start going live. Because I would love to talk to you all, all the time. So, thank you for tuning in. Thank you for subscribing, for liking, for sharing, for commenting. For just spending some time with me. And remember, you stay blessed because you are blessed.